Hey guys! Today, I have a question and let me know in the comment section if you agree with it. Do you think a good wife defines on how well she cooks? Because we have this kind of stereotype in the Philippines that it's shameful for a woman to her husband if she doesn't know how to do household chores. I don't cook when I was in the Philippines because I did not know how to do it. When I came here, I started learning cooking and I started loving it as well. For today's video, I'm gonna prepare a lunch for Kuba before he arrives from work and let's see if I'm really a good cook. First, we need Napa cabbage or different kind of cabbage is fine. The celery, which is also a good option. Onion, garlic, eggs, a grated pork or chicken. So what is this recipe? It's actually a Napa cabbage roll. So let's start. First, we're going to prepare the cabbage. So we will need the, the pot and fill it with the water. Wait up until it boils because we need to here uh, we need to boil the cabbage to make it smoother for our roll later so while waiting for the cabbage i'm gonna prepare the carrots sometimes i would say that when we were in the philippines it is very boring for us because we usually eat vegetables like almost every day and we can only sometimes eat pork but it's quite opposite here. You're eating a lot of porks or other meats almost every day, but you can't, like, you know, you have options, but um, in the Philippines, people are always prioritizing vegetables rather than meats, maybe because meats are very expensive. But here, it's quite opposite because they don't have much vegetables, I would say, compared to the Philippines. So I really can't think of other oh, things to prepare, but good thing i remember that we have a cabbage roll and i think this is very interesting since goba is on a diet he doesn't want to eat carbs and this is a very good option for him Chote. Hey. <laughs> he's here already how are you good <laughs> how's work Hello guys, I am here as well. Welcome back. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. We will move on to the cooking. So Yeah, I thought I'm gonna finish it before you arrive, but I'm very slow. So you can start in the carrot. Let me know guys in the comments what do you think about Gwen's cooking outfit? <laughs> if the women who are working as a chef would be wearing this every day at work. Why not? It will be dirty. <laughs> Why not? So celery. <laughs> I want it to look good in the camera. That's fine. Onion. <laughs> Some spices. Garlic. We have dried garlic, but we don't have powdered one already. Gwen actually doesn't understand what's written on the sacks with the spices. She's just putting it randomly. That's true. <laughs> this one would be good because it's for grounded meat. And black pepper. This is black pepper? The thing what Gwen said that you can add anything to your cooking, like that's the true and lie in the same time. The cooking itself you can really let your fantasy cook, you can add different kind of spices, ingredients and you can still make delicious foods but if there is certain recipe you should keep with the ingredients but even if you are not you can still make delicious foods, that's what's amazing about cooking. Let your fantasy cook. Is it uh, oyster sauce? I don't know what's that Poison. sauce. Poison, I don't know. But yeah, you can add oyster sauce on it. Uh oh. Now mix it together. I'm gonna use my hands. Good. Gwen is not afraid to get dirty. <laughs> of course, it's cooking. <laughs> Which key? I need spices. But not much because it's 
right? Salty. What? What's so funny about mixing <laughs> meat with a couple of carrots? I imagine something! <laughs> what? Let's start wrapping it. But we don't have big ones kind of cabbage. <laughs> it's so small. Oh. You like big ones? Yeah, I want the big ones. Mm -hmm. Why not? Well, that's what girls want big ones and still complaining about small ones. What do you mean by that? Hmm? Specifically what? Hmm? Specifically you know what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you talking about? The cabbage, of course. <laughs> Stop it. And intentionally I bought the small one because yeah. I was thinking we, I will buy a big one and then it will get spoiled in the fridge. But I did no. not know we are going to make the rolls. So. Oh no. my gosh, it will be a big problem. We cannot close it. You can. Oh. No well. excuses. Make sure guys that you will buy big cabbage, okay? Because you will have a problem later in cooking it. So here we have our first spring roll spring roll <laughs> it looks spring because it's green <laughs> like this it should be like this baby i think there's only one that's big we will be back once the plate is full of another rolls i'm done rolling 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 it <laughs> so we're going to steam it this time so i prepared water here possible it is possible like guys if you don't really have steamer you don't have to invest to it if you are not steaming like maybe every week you can just use this strainer then you will place your rolls or dumplings or anything you want to steam then you will place a lid and it's also wrapped around with the towel so the steam will not be escaping and you can keep the temperature <clears throat> and so you have to cook it for 15 minutes here is a tip for all men around watching this video once your wife starts cooking very green meals what do you mean it's a sign for you that she wants you to lose some weight what no so basically she is telling you that you are fat no what are you talking about so here we are like that we don't want to be on fire guys, so make sure you will, the edges are at the top and now we can just wait. So I guess it's already cooked, let's see, quite, it's hot. Is it? Is it? Is it? I'm not sure. I guess it is, right? So then it's cooked. Mm, it's delicious. I'm gonna try sweet chili sauce too. I think it's better with the sweet chili sauce. Small. So Jacob is here already. Here, my key. Sit down, please. <laughs> Let's see if I passed. Being a good wife. <laughs> of course we did. Already. <laughs> Let me know your comments. You should be a good judge. It looks very healthy. <laughs> and you know what I you say. You know it has a, a low calories. Mm -hmm. It has more protein. Mm -hmm. So it's very good for diet. Everything what's healthy is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm quite scared. What are you doing when you're taking it slow? How is it? It's not oily, right? As usual, I make. I'm usually making oily foods. Mm. Is it good? You want more sauce? Is it disgusting? <laughs> you're not saying anything. It makes me scared. Can I feel it? <laughs> yeah. It tastes good, like the filling made of pork and vegetable. It tastes good. It will balance the the good and the bad taste of the Napa cabbage. It, like the cabbage itself is without the taste actually. Mm -hmm. But mixed with the pork it it is good. It's your first time, right? 
It is my first time. I would say, if we will say it's like healthy lumpias. Better than lumpia. No. The Filipino type of mm. lumpia. <laughs> Absolutely not. No, really? You said like lumpia and the Philippines are the best? Mm -hmm. I hope this content is quite informative for you guys. And I'm very happy that I made you happy. Are you happy? <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> So here I am guys, happy husband. Happy husband is the one with full stomach, which Gwen made sure my stomach is filled. It was delicious actually. Different kind of food we eat like every day. Yeah, because you usually have just meat. I want something with vegetables too. But there was pork. Yeah, but some, like mixed with vegetable and pork rather than just meat alone. It's kind of boring already. <laughs> I should be thankful and grateful for everything, but just an honest uh, comment. Right? Gwen will be thankful for comment and we both will be thankful if you like this video, if you hit some comment, anything. If you are new to this channel, my name is Jacob. My wife hey, is Gwen. Hey, our channel is called Filipina Checking. We make daily life videos. Visit our channel, you will find there a bunch more other videos. And here we are in the end. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.